Boop. Boop. And boop. Okay. New story. Are you okay? Hello. Hi. There we go. Okay. Fucking Discord. Yup. Okay. <coughs> we cool with these colors, or would you like me to change them? I don't have you. <laughs> I don't have you. Right. Uh, yeah. Discord. And I closed Twitch as soon as I heard my own voice again. Yep. Uh, share. Whoop. Go do that a little bit. Then boop. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm good with those colors. Cool. Uh, custom playthrough. That way we can do the most no. shit. Yeah. I don't know shit about this game except Pony almost died. Yeah. It's ba Have you ever played? Uh, I think it's Arkham Horror. It's a board game. Mm -hmm. Nope. It's basically a, a John J.E. 2 sim, like, inspired version of that. Okay. Like, these are the different card packs you can unlock that give you extra stuff once you've unlocked them. Alright. Base game. Anything you unlock through the achievements. Mm -hmm. Extra students, which I don't know what that's for. And then just extra shit. Alright. Which I haven't unlocked, because I haven't played much yet. <laughs> Do you want to give me a seed or should I randomize? Uh, randomize. Tell me when to stop. Now. City of Shiroka, Japan, 1980X. Something strange is happening in our town. Rogue figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. Favorite kind of stuff. The rapid technological process of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown threats and horniness. Hi. <laughs> Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who pulled the earth, who, who ruled the earth eons ago, are awakening as reality starts to crumble. Um, with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across the city and in realms beyond. Yes. Let's okay. do it. Oh, hey, world. look, there's a picture of you. Listen. <laughs> I've drawn that face. <laughs> Who are you going to be? Um, I don't know. We got 
Kyrie, who's knowledgeable about string, starts with a random spell. Eiko Takahashi, who's very good with dexterity but not great with knowledge, who gets a speed bonus, which is really useful. Mm -hmm. Haru, strength minus knowledge, starts with secrets, which isn't a mechanic I really know that well. Mizuki Hamasaki, charisma, strength minus strength, but gets an ally, which is always useful. Okay. Koji Tagawa, perception minus dexterity, starts with a camera. Which could be useful depending on the quest. Okay. And Mimi. Knowledge, dexterity, but starts with a scalpel. Oof. Fuck yeah, Mimi. Cool. What background do we want? Either generic one that has no effect. Medical history. I start with extra XP and bandages, but an injury whenever may occur whenever I take damage. Okay. Or hunted by the cold. <gasps> I, uh, <laughs> uh, judging by that reaction, I know what to do. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, no one has a face because they don't get a face until you decide on them. Because sometimes the backstories will give them facial features and whatnot. Uh, not random stats. Another thing up game will draw generic character exclusives. No, we'll just get random perks. Okay. Listen, no one has a personality until the world is created. That's how it works. Obviously. Yeah. Uh, what's the difficulty? So that's easy, <clears throat> easier, middle, hard, and fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you choose that one. <laughs> we'll go middle. Okay. Actually, I haven't played Mimi, so we'll... We'll go with one of the go easy ones. It? Yeah, if we want to go easy, that's fine. Then we can get the feel for it. Yeah, we're going to shit. I call bullshit, Robin. Oh, I forgot to close my door. Oh, well. And... Somewhere, a group of people gathers, trying to awaken their master. What god do we yes. want to fight? Oh, shit! Uh, what? There's the spider. The terrible okay. spider god, Kithag Atarasu, is once again waking from its slumber. Blinded by its impossible to satisfy hunger, it decided to tear down the walls of its cocoon prison. Its effect is you can't run from combat. Ooh. Then there is... Idhotu, the devouring fire. This supposed cause of destruction of the Library of Alexandria, a perfectly black marble statue. <laughs> Are you though? Are you Robin? Uh, has been recently discovered and is currently awaiting in the Museum of OOO for its long awaited premiere. Entropy. Both your damage and the enemy's da is increased. So, okay. everything hits fucking hard. Okay. Ath Yolats, the towering eye. The mad god favors astronomers and musicians, granting them its power, of, its gift of power that unknowingly brings its bloated body closer and closer to Earth. Casting spells cost reason. Oh, any spells that cost reason cost doom instead, which is strong for a spell casting build. Okay. Then, Goizo, the thing forsaken by God. Banished to the other dimension a long time ago, Goizo has found a way to use mirrors to ensnare and teleport its prey straight through a refractive glass. The glimpses behind your reflections are just the beginning of the real nightmare. And it has the fucking worst one where resting increases yeah. doom. So... Does Doom, like, just fuck you over a lot? Uh, Doom is basically your, your timer. Okay. Everything you do gets cost Doom, and obviously when you fuck up, you get more Doom. And then at certain percentages, you'll get negatives that start affecting the entire town. Okay. I'm thinking either the Destruction guy or the Astronomer guy. The middle two. Yeah, I don't oh. want to do... S we're not doing a spell cast, we're doing a deck, so let's go damage then. Okay. That part, <laughs> there was something on that screen that looked like a dick. <laughs> Get a new status, Mimi's obsession. Oh, brilliant, I start off with minus re reason. Uh oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We're adorable, look at that. Yeah. So I'm just going to get mailbox full of animal entrails. Ooh! That's the cult. Because that does only happens on, on the, the cult background. 
Yay! Uh, free entrails! <laughs> before we before we decide on an outfit, let's get my free money. Because there's always a free money in that little robot when you start a playthrough. Cute. Uh, okay, so let's see. So this is the nurse outfit. Good girl outfit. Tank top. Pop culture. Or surf. I'm partial to the pop culture one. Pop culture? There you can go with that. Uh, then take a bath, because we can get free experience. Uh, I gotta remember the button. There, right, I can do everything with these. Oh, gotta equip my scalpel. Damage four. Oh, not bad. Oh, got a free item. Library notes. Use it. Gain a spell. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. Absorb. Deals three damage gain. Ooh. Nice. No, the Jeff the Killer's more an American thing. She'd have, like, the, the Kuchisaka Ona to be obsessed with. Who we might end up fighting. Nice. Uh, anything else? Mysteries. Oh, t always take a peek. Oh, hi there. <laughs> Creeper. <laughs> uh, Mine earthquake in the seaside region through an entrance to a partially flooded cave cavern system. Yeah, if I remember correctly, if you check the news, you can f ha find out what either events are happening in your playthrough or events that are happening that aren't in your playthrough. Okay, okay. We had a bath with the people. Let's choose our mystery. Chilling suit, chronicle of crimson cape. I do like capes. Alarming encounter of abnormal arms. Rotten report of a rancid ramen. Tragic tale of the thaumaturgy teacher. Eerie episode of evolving eels. What do you feel like? Eels is good because you get an ally out of it. Alright. But it also involves some eye horror. <laughs> um. With this game, I should be okay. If not, I will find out and I'll find a new warning. Ooh, I can reroll my mysteries. I didn't know you could do that. Oh shit. Um. Uh... Uh, I'm not going to reroll because these are all. Because you can tell the difficulty of a m mystery by the amount of endings it has. Yeah. So, two, two, two are generally the easy to medium ones. Threes okay. are the medium to hard. Four to fives okay. are the really hard ones. Yeah, okay. Well, returning to your home, someone bumps into you. Did you know? You turn around. It's your friend living in the same apartment complex. Connor. That weird look that weird dude is back. You know, the one who studies the fish. You shrug, opening the door. Connor follows and immediately enters the kitchen. A while later, she returns with two cans of soda. Aren't you curious? What weird fish did he bring this time? She grins. Investigate. Okay, Kana, what do you do? Ooh, yes. That's a really good perk. We receive one less damage during combat. Nice. Yeah. So the base of the game is you go to locations and you can in investigate them. Mm -hmm. So like at the moment we're at home and mm -hmm. what you can do there is here. Okay. So what we can do at home is rest. But if we were to go to the school, go to the schoolyard to recruit mm -hmm. allies and learn about stuff, go to the library to learn magic, mm -hmm. stuff like that. And this All is right. the threat level, which rises depending on the level of doom, and it will change depending on each area. Okay, okay. So now it's kind of low, is that what it's saying? Yeah, we have zero doom up here. Uh, so okay. nothing's really affected yet. Mm -hmm. Alright. And, and then this is the side objective. It allows it, 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 it usually helps you get the better ending. Mm -hmm. But that's only for the easier ones. The... The harder ones have multiple endings that sometimes, but sometimes aren't connected to this. Right, okay. So it wants us to investigate the seaside. Let's go! 
How much oh. money do I got? Six funds. Uh... Also, of course, we're going to be obsessed with murderers in this playthrough because I'm here. <laughs> yeah. I listen to too much true crime. Uh, let's go to the puppy. Oh, <gasps> puppy! Ooh, compass. Compass gives us experience every time we do anything. Nice! Uh, I still have four more funds. I still need a B slot. Let me get steak knife. Steak knife? No. Light sauce. What's up, Perception? Perception 7. Huh. Knowledge. Wait, Scalpel is a knowledge weapon, isn't it? Yes, it is. Let's grab the camera. Yeah. And this is our inventory that you have like, your weapon, your... I want to say armor, but it's not armor. But that's like th where the the armor would go, and then you have your bonus. Okay, so something like an equipped item, you yeah. can put a camera on your neck and just kind of let it be there. Yeah. Oh, oh that's right. Uh, it, 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 they, these ones generally give you a, a bonus action in combat to do something. All right. Whereas All right. your C ones will generally give you a passive. All right. Yeah. And we have four inventory slots. Despite the fact it's showing six, these ones are technically grayed out. That's what A, the, the uh, kind of thicker borders here. All right. I, I would need yeah. to get a backpack to use them. Uh huh. Okay, explore the seaside. Let's go! The waves lazily wash upon the sewer. Take a deep breath. The fresh air, sea air clears your head. Oh, nice. We've got a good, good one. Yeah! Once more. And we lost more health. A hit yeah. me continues with record temperatures. Continuing rescue takes more and more effort. Yeah. You may be going crazy, but you swear something is watching you from the sea. Minus one reason. Whoop. Yeah. And now to actually progress the mission, you go to go to wherever the circle is. Mm hmm. Wandering through an empty corridor, you find an old vending machine. You don't recognize the brand of soda inside, but you really could use a drink. You're gonna go expensive or cheap? Uh. uh oh, in this, it doesn't Wait. mean like there's a certain amount of money. It means this one costs money, this one doesn't. Because that's how. Oh, I'm so sorry about that cheap one then. Oh, the, 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 the thing about this is that all encounters have a good and bad option for both of them. And uh -huh. it all depends on get, your luck and your other abilities. Get the expensive one. You just get vibes from it. And we got nothing. Well, I mean, that's better than bad. Yeah. I mean, I think that is the bad option for that one. Because you don't get no. anything out of it. Oh. You just waste a fund. Yeah. Rip. Okay. Delicious uh, soda, though. <laughs> Dude's working at school, right? We could break into his office. What do you mean we shouldn't? <laughs> Connor, I love you. <laughs> Hearing eerie sound coming from behind the door, you decide to check it out. At first glance, the abandoned classroom seems empty. Once your eyes get used to the darkness, you discover an unusual sigil drawn on the floor. Judging by the smoke, someone put out the candles the moment you entered. <gasps> the candles, pick up the book, or study the writing on the blackboard. Oh, uh, writing on the blackboard. Yeah, that makes sense with our knowledge. Uh, that, that's that's not, not a bad option. We actually got a spell out of it. Noise. What did we Let's get? Oh. Gain some cauterize. Plus two stamina, one time use only. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. The neighbor's office at school is empty. You do find a few jars, all filled with weird eel-like creatures. Despite your protests, Connor decides to take one home. Why? No, Connor. Have you ever seen an eel like this? It's so freaky. Don't you have a feeling it's watching us? Yes, it is! Well, let's just have a quick rest. Andy's. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 
all the characters are really into women. It doesn't matter which I one mean, you play, they are, they're into women. Have you seen women? Yes, yeah. that's why I can't disagree with them. <laughs> you you disagree with them all the time. <laughs> He said, do you only disagree with me on my dude days? <laughs> need to fight. You need to track us. Oh, God. Excuse <laughs> me, do you have a moment to talk about our real lord and savior? The reckoning is coming, says the voice on the other side of the line. You definitely don't like the way the man on the other side of the line has a, puts an accent on real. Hello, are you still there? Hang up immediately. Hang up. You put down the phone, a little shaken. Just how many people did that odd man call today? I'm not making the best choices. <laughs> no, the thing about this game is there are no, like, every choice has a, has a good o way of fucking you over or not. Okay. Like, th th this, this game is basically a a simulator of um, minimizing your, your how much attrition happens to you. Okay. Like, you're not, you're not expected to win. Okay. <laughs> I've seen him burning some notes behind our apartment building. Let's go and check it out. I heard... something else. <laughs> oh? <laughs> he was bowing. <laughs> as, you, as you prepare a bath, you think about all the possible leads so far. You're very tired, so maybe ice cold water is a good idea. What sort of bath should we have? Uh, sure, let's go with the cold bath idea. Nice! We got a good... Okay. The, yeah, every... Every event has a has hidden checks. Okay. okay. Whenever, whenever there's a check, it means you technically got the bad one, but because your ability was more than enough, you you get the positive benefit of it. Yeah, I. Ooh, burn notes. Kenna was right. Someone tried to burn some papers. They must have been in a hurry because some of the papers look salvageable. You both return your apartment and try to decipher the notes. Yes. Inspect. Legends from the prefecture prefecture eels tell of a small village of robbers who would kill all visitors and dump their corpse into a lake full of eels. Eels of the prefecture would lay their eggs inside you. That's so weird. Your neighbor was really into these eels, it seems. All scientists have like a very specific niche they love. No. Yes. Not wanting to wait for an elevator, you start to take the rail you use stairs. You suddenly trip, but grab to the rail at the last, last second. Man, I can read. When you get up to inspect what caused you to trip, you freeze in terror. It is slowly standing up. <laughs> oh no! Ooh. Gary! Uh, how much damage do I do? I do four, what's that? I might do more, so. because based on my knowledge. Speed. We also have the destruction thing, right? So you might do more? Or is it already... I will find out when I do some... Okay. Oh, it's a fucking ghost. Wait, hang on. I don't have ghost weapons. We have to do a different way of doing it. Okay. Uh, it's a situation. How did you trip over a ghost? Because it, it wasn't a ghost when we tripped over it. Oh. Severed ties to their world. Fuck it. Oh, well, we were doing about five damage each time. That this is also the the, the special ghost ability. Mm. There must be something more where we can learn. I'll try to break into his apartment tomorrow morning. Wonder what he's hiding in there. Kana is something else. <laughs> I'm gonna break into his apartment. Hello, my fail. Yolo. It's fine. Uh, we don't have the perks, so we don't get to choose. Suddenly, the area around you begins to whirl. A supernatural wave of freezing wind is approaching. Bam, bam. Oh! The wizard chills oh. you to the bone and disappears as quickly as it began. I mean, technically, Connor is the main character of the, the current mystery. Think about how stupid it is of Connor to try and break into your neighbor's apartment. You go to sleep. I'm glad we're all on the same page <laughs> with Connor. You spend an entire day waiting for Kana. Where the hell is she? We're so alone on our loading screen. Wait, why is it suddenly so dark outside? You stand by the window to take a look. 
Black smog emerges from the courtyard, coating everything in an oily vapor. Observe or run? Observe. Ooh. Sludgy vapors rise slowly upward, forming a perfect spiral. You back away from the window, surprised by this curious phenomenon. <laughs> Eight spirits, nice. Oh, we're at the end of it. Kana has been missing since yesterday. You decided to check out your neighbor's apartment for yourself. Oh no! <laughs> Cautiously enter your neighbor's kitchen. You are shocked to see countless jars filled with eels, flailing around restlessly. Where the hell is Kana? Maybe we can go the eel that to the bathroom, the bedroom, or we can escape. Uh, bathroom. Good choice. <laughs> Soul and body of your neighbor is rotting away inside putrid murky water. Both his eyes are missing with countless tiny blood trails leading from them in all directions. Bedroom! Let's go! I, I found the neighbor, but, but when his eyes burst, I've slipped on the bottom of consciousness. I'm afraid there's something in my own eyes now. Oh no! So we can go to the hospital, or we can perform our own surgery. Oh! I can tell you what the right answer is, because I already know it. Why don't you do it then? Let's perform some surgery. Okay. Okay. I'm looking away. Yeah. I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> Is she an illithid? Nope. She's, speci she's specifically not because we performed surgery. We can't even survive the blood loss. He's Probably not. Safe to look You rush to the hospital, Connor, getting a lot of attention from horrified people. Fred is taken immediately to the operating theater, and you collapse on a ch on a chair in the waiting area, fall asleep. Wake up, dude! You've been sleeping for over three hours. You quickly open your eyes to see your friend. Connor is wearing an eye patch. Not so pretty anymore, eh? I couldn't exactly tell the doctors the truth about what happened. I'm pretty sure I won't be waking with my left eye anymore time soon. But thank you for saving my it's life. It's okay. You can wear an eye patch and be a pirate and be super sexy. You're still processing the events of the previous night. Corpse eating eels that lay their eggs in eyes, sitting around with your friend Kana before your your building before your apartment building. You watch the police officers emptying out your neighbor's place. Ending A. That's the good ending. Oh yeah. Because the other ending kinda dies. Oh. Well, so I think either she dies or she comes possessed by the eels. Oh shit. Thirty experience. And because it did such a good job, fifteen an extra fifteen. Nice. Minus four. That that was it for the mystery. That that was that mystery. Yes. Okay. Okay. Level, oh, hang on. Old god stirs. What effect are we getting? Yeah. Every time you you beat a mission, the old god forces a status effect on the town. Okay. The air feels heavy, making it hard to breathe. What's that do? Uh, rest is less is less effective. That sucks. Let's level up! Yeah! Coast connection. Completes letting Mr. Grant a spell. Quick thinking. Plus one dex. Plus we get the quick thinking perk. First aid. Defeating enemy get, regains two reason. Which one? I like the quick thinking one. Quick thinking? Yep, that'd be good. And then we can we can get a plus one to any perk or a plus five to one of our health pools. Um, not sure. Let's go knowledge. That way we got plus ten knowledge. Oh, oh. no, Robin. I'll, 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 because because of how Japanese culture is, a lot of them are head down. Is it affecting me? Nope. Don't care. I'm not going to worry about it. Because yeah. if you, if you pay attention to it, you're drawing attention to it. Mm-hmm. That's how a lot of their their spirits work. Yeah, you gotta remember this is Japan, not America. Yep. We are technically the crazy one because we're we're investigating. Inside your mailbox, you find a small key. What is it doing there? Take. Yeah, and to get to the final boss, we need to get all five keys. Well, oh. which you get for completing a mystery. Okay. Take a bath. Extra stamina. What's my. Let's get some reason back. Uh, if we want to change outfits? I'm good with our outfit. Okie dokie. 
We're an anime character. We need to wear the same thing every day. <laughs> Which one do you want to do? Uh, cape. Cape? Okay. Cape. <laughs> New game is spreading among your friends. A dare to stay in the unused school restroom after class. A dare to meet Akamanto. Was originally harmless. Fun has turned deadly. The body of a boy was found last week. The school principal has banned the game, but that's only made it more popular. A commando must be stopped before another kid is killed. Uh -huh. Got the... Okay. So this one is weird because you need to actually know about it. You gotta go to the schoolyard and talk to people. Uh, where's the gossip button? Latest gossip. Ask you which paper what you must refuse everything. And that's the one we want. Yeah! We got really lucky. Yeah. You heard some version of the legend. Everyone agrees you can't take anything that the man offers you, though. Uh, hey, let's go. We can do this. Uh, well, what the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna fucking rest. Okay. Because this guy hits fucking hard. <laughs> Sudden blast of heat grabs your attention. An older man standing next to you screams of pain as he's engulfed in fire from, si from seemingly nowhere. As other people start to panic and help the burn victim, it's about a hooded woman standing in the distance. When she sees you, she starts to run. You can't shake off the feeling that you were the target of the supernatural attack. I guess we have no choice with that. The hooded woman dis disappears behind a corner, and when you get there, she's gone. Already mixed in with the crowd. In a nearby dumpster, you find the sulfur sneaking hoodie and an envelope containing your photo. plus a curious incantation. We got a spell. Yeah. Noise. Oh, that's that's an expensive spell, but eight fucking damage. Because because uh, that like that's a lot of that's not the, like most most enemies half half the health points. Okay, okay. Because anything that have usually above twenty are like literal eldritch gods. Mhm. Mm okay. Investigate. Through the dirty restaurant window, you notice a shady-looking man wearing a jacket covered in strange symbols. He steps in front of a house, visibly nervous. Before he hits the house, he turns, it ar he turns around as if he's checking for any animal to follow us. What could it mean? Follow him, call the police, do nothing, or ask the waiter? Ask the waiter. Before pursuing the man, you ask if the waiter... You ask the waiter... Is this... <laughs> yeah. That's one way to go, Robin. <laughs> you ask the waiter if they know him. The waiter smiles and explains that the man is a part of a tabletop role-playing community. Oh, he's one of us! Yeah. Hey. You think him slight you think him slightly embarrassed. I was gonna say, it's just me, but then he was <laughs> gonna be like a weird horror, and I was like, no, we don't say that. But well, he is us. I mean that is that is technically one of the ways this this event plays out. <laughs> <laughs> we we just got the no, he's a normal normal person one. Yay! The pool is empty at this hour. It's dark, but you could, you could swear something suddenly moved under the surface of the water. Step closer, check out the lockers, turn on the lights. Turn on fucking lights! Don't step closer! <laughs> you turn on the lights, luckily for you, no horrors lock in the water. Plus one reason. Like, now! <laughs> yeah, weird that. <laughs> one of the articles mentions a young doctor who performed life-saving surgery on a, on a victim of a brutal assault. The assault happened in a toilet. Maybe he still works at the hospital and can share some information. Oh. As a part of the therapy, some patients took took part in art classes. Some of their works fill you with dread. Yeah. I mean, that means good art. It's the yellow sign. That means this place is protected. Oh. And then the doctor suddenly. <laughs> the one guy exploded in flames that got, then got attacked on the toilet. <laughs> that would suck. That would be the worst day. Yeah. You know that the doctor suddenly left the hospital after the latest murder, taking all the records with him. Why would he do that? That's not the only bad news. Your friend didn't come to school today, and another body has supposedly been found. Oh no! It's not Kana, so that's, that's fine. Oh, okay. A tall woman with an okay. unsettling face and twitching lips stops you. 
I'll be right new biology so teacher. Could <laughs> you help me move some stuff to my new office? No! Fuck off! Decline? Decline, please. You, she she no. suddenly grabs your hand. Oh, I insist. No, no touch. We have to help her, we don't get a choice. Oh, okay. Luck check, success. The creepy substitute teacher hands you some old books to carry. Among the mundane titles, you find one called Extinction of Mankind. You shudder, feeling the teacher's gaze on your back. Oof. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Scary. I couldn't do this by myself. That's what you got me for. Yeah. Armed by the sound of glass breaking, you discover the corpse of a policeman lying in a pool of blood. Looks like someone or something tore out his throat. Steal his gun, uh, check his wound for clues, escape before more people arrive. Uh, um, Tef, we're not stealing his gun. Yeah, because we, do, we don't have bullets. See? No yeah. bullets. Okay, um... Oh, goodness. Uh... Remember, we are an investigator. Well, yeah, let's check his wounds. They didn't tear out his throat, but instead carved an occult symbol with something sharp. You try to remember the shape, and escape before anyone arrives. We have experience. Yay! Nice! <clears throat> you break the window and get inside the school unnoticed. The cursed toilet is located on the third floor. Get over there. Cursed, cursed toilet! <laughs> Like, Let's go! This is actually based on like a, a common like curse in Japanese mythology. Oh fuck yes! Let's go! Weird bubbling sound lures you into a dark shower room. On the floor, you find a swimsuit thrown over a grotesque leathery coil. Wait, that's not a coil. <laughs> Drain ah. swimmer? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Where's the repair attack? Boop. Mm. What's the circle's clear? What are your allies to attack? Kick. Satellite. There we go. That. That. That's 85% chance of 7 damage. Twice. Yes, I like that. Uh, save it. Launch! And you failed! No! Reload, boom. Got a! Yay! Did we get any items? Nope. There is no turning back. You step into the last door and close the door behind you. Okay, Investigate okay. cursed toilet. Let's do it! You wait in the store, trying to be as quiet as possible. Suddenly, squish! Squeak! You hear the sound of rubber boots as an unknown liquid drips onto the tiles. Squish, squeak. You see the top of his head. He's taller than any man you've ever seen. Squish, squeak. The door slowly opens. Prepare! A masked ah! man dressed in a red coat, clearly too tall for the ceiling, emerges from outside. His voice sounds like a faulty radio. Would you like red paper or blue paper? Neither! I don't want anything? Yeah! It's getting darker. Yeah? Tall man in the red cloak slowly takes the mask off as stole walls wither and rot, and reality starts to crumble. Uh oh. Akamanto, true form! Ah! Now that guy has no face. Well, yeah, because he's holding it for you. <laughs> oh, that's a new way to say his face was in his hands. <laughs> nah, it's not worth using. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> And then he had to take his face off, so because no one's as tall as him, he has to make sure they can reach his lips. We survived! Yay! When you wake up, you find yourself back in the toilet stall. Thinking it was all a dream, you stand up, and the air are cracked from under your shoe. There lies a broken, crimson mask. Akamanto might 
return one day, but now, but now you know that ancient horrors can be defeated. Ending A. Yay! Well, let's see, what's the god doing? Winds of plague, a weird ep epidemic keeps staff at the hospital busy, skipping the line will cost you more. Basically, okay. using the hospital just costs more money. That's fine. Okay. Level up. Oh, I pressed too many things, apparently. Uh, discipline. Gains one stamina for all successful events. Skill, skill checks? Nice. Uh, I don't know what that one is. Faster combat actions for each ally you have. I mean, a lot of Elder Towers can be killed just by stabbing them, because they have to become corporeal. Yeah. Ooh, hot bath. Imp improved resting at home. I mean, we might need that because, like, one of the gods yeah. effects less Count effective that. resting, right? Yeah. Uh... What's What attribute should we upgrade? I don't know. We got a nice spread. Let's do luck. It's anything okay. we can't see. Oh, I just noticed, if you have this, the cultist background, you lose one doom at the start of every day. Yes. That's that's useful. We have another key? Watch TV. Some of our readers report a strange tall man, dressed in white, taking the metro after dark, apparently stalking lone passengers. Please take care and avoid travelling alone. Spooky. Oh, we've got an important thing. People... Oh, yeah. Damn it, nothing. And a bath. Uh, we need reason. Cool. Do you want some arms, some rotten ramen, or do you want to deal with a teacher? Um, arms. For all the hugs. I remember when it started. The woman next door was strangled to death in, in her bed with no signs of forced entry. The killer was never found, and the apartment remained vacant. <gasps> a murder mystery! Let's go! <laughs> the daughter apartment was closed and she lived alone. What other way? What other ways in are there? Maybe you can get Window. the apartment plan to go. Listen! <laughs> it's not spooky when you say the obvious. <laughs> let's get, actually, let's fucking rest first. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it, it's back to to the original that that it was. Yay! <laughs> Let's go one more. There we go. All right, investigate the hospital twice. We went to the hospital looking for information about a certain patient. The main corridor is dark and strangely empty. It's what a nurse at the registration booth. She's asleep from exhaustion. Should we sneak past her? Let her sleep. Or oh, set the crash can on fire. <laughs> oh no! Oh, sneak <laughs> after, please. Oh, we managed. You managed to sneak past her and rummage through the cabinet. Finally, you locate the, the information you were looking for. Yay! You meet with your friend, who has recently started her nurse practice. You lazy chat on the roof of the hospital, watching the sunset. Now would be the perfect opportunity to ask about the recent unearthly events. Ask about them, or don't ruin the moment. Ask, please. Her stories about missing patients, mysterious surgeries, and a strange infection are helpful, but they kill the mood. You must leave this place. <laughs> you must leave this place. <laughs> because you are too awkward. <laughs> Inadequate museum archive displays a specimen for elongated arms and jellified bones. Ooh. Lovely. You're pleasantly surprised to meet your old friend while waiting for a train. She's undoubtedly changed a lot since you last seen her. These days, she's moderating a web forum dedicated to the paranormal. Maybe she knows something useful? 
chat or invite for coffee? Um, are those the same thing? Uh, Don't you chat over coffee? Look who you're talking uh, to. You think I do coffee shit? Yeah, let's do coffee. Fuck it. In between conspiracy theories and Bigfoot signs, you hear a worrying rumor about an old god slowly awakening to rule the earth once again. Does this be the reason for future? For recent horrific events, Ooh, I spent. I spent all our money. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I mean, technically, I spent all our money because that's where we got the camera and the compass from. I mean, yeah. And yeah, that's that's pretty much how much it cost, Robin. Because like, in Lovecraftian games, fund isn't like direct one to one. It's an a, a decent amount of money is one fund. I mean, my my usual order at the coffee place I go to is worth it because I mean, <laughs> it's peanut butter flavored. Nice. And I will defend that. That's twenty bucks American. Yeah. When you stop by home to pick up your lunchbox, you find a pile of letters in your mailbox. Read the letters or check them um, later. Yeah, we might have a bill in there. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I check fail. No! no! That's good, we didn't have any funds to begin with. <laughs> Fuck you, game. <laughs> Told you we had a bill! I never saw it! You did! <laughs> Your math senses were tingling. They were tingling. My math and adult senses. I'm finished painting. While looking around the insect room of your recently deceased friend, you discover a half finished painting of a woman, her skin a ghastly pale yellow color. Seen yeah, they haven't done the shading, color. because skin <laughs> has yellow in it, like, it's obviously not a finished painting, it's fine. Yeah, but this is a ghastly pale yellow. Yeah, they were having a hard time figuring out the yellow balance in the skin color they wanted. <laughs> it's fine. Char Charisma ch check success. Unintimidated <laughs> by the painting, it gives you a new insight into the madness that possessed your friend. What the fuck does that mean? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Madness, that possess your friend? They're not- it's not a kink. They're not the weird ghastly yellow people. <laughs> They're not into the minions. How do you know that? Because I was a woman and not a bean. <laughs> <laughs> the telephone sounds and multiple voices are too loud for you to ignore. When you enter the apartment, everything turns silent. Ooh, spooky! Gossip Junkie. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> she, she spreads a nasty rumor about us. Oh, uh, yeah, I've had that happen. So we'll come back. And a level up. We'll go over the nasty rumor in 20 years when we <laughs> finally decide, hey, what the fuck? No one cares. <laughs> Smaller Doom penalty then... from running for combat. Small XP bonus for casting spells. Plus one knowledge, and we know about various rituals and regional myths. I kind of like that last one. Yeah, that's, that, that one's an actual useful perk for some events. Uh... Which one should we upgrade? Um, you said our is generally okay. I'm okay with um upping our luck again if you want. Yeah, luck's never a bad option. Yeah. About missing underwear, I'm sure that's just a pervert. I mean, technically, the answer is is both things. It is a oh, pervert, no. and it's oh, raining blood. Woman oh. jumps out and out of her apartment, covered in gore. Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower when suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads into the dark apartment. Calm her down. Check uh. the bathroom. Uh, check the bathroom. No, let's check. You don't enter the bathroom. Instead, <laughs> you go straight to the building's boiler room. One pipe coming from the ground. It looks like it was it was railed to the to the central system recently. Where does it lead? Oh. 
Man. Girl, I'm sorry. You trailed that blood all over your apartment, and you're gonna have to get it out of everything. And you're just gonna be like, <laughs> "What the fuck?" It's fine. I already have to clean my own blood up. Why do I have to clean random blood up? <laughs> Mr. R R your neighbor is a horror mm. that He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his newest story. Share your experience. And he come up with stuff on his own. What's that picture? What's the picture? Show me the picture. Oh, this is actually a secret boss. <gasps> I don't. I think we're we're too far in to actually be able to properly trigger it though. Okay. Because you need to trigger it three times and then get the right event and then it then you fight it. Okay. Like, that's what this is. It means you you can now encounter it. Okay. All right. You catch a glimpse of this painted thing. Suddenly you feel weak and excuse yourself to leave. Something truly evil has you in its grasp. Well, is can it ask me out to dinner? No. Damn. Let's check the building plan to find out if there is a place where all the vents connect. Why? Because <laughs> we're trying to figure what? out we're trying to figure out how that guy got in, remember? Oh right. I mean check the window. Well, I mean I don't think fire escapes are like that easily accessible in Japan. Oh, that's fair. Okay. Maybe he had a copy of the key. Did you check all her keys? Passing by a faulty elevator, its door suddenly opened. You take a step back, noticing a weird tall woman standing in the darkness. That's me! Stop being mean to me! <laughs> Do you live here? I've never seen you. Oh my. Don't think that's oh. you. No, I have two eyes. Yeah. I don't smile that big. I don't like my smile. So almost like you have self-esteem issues. What? I know. Me? Self-esteem issues? How weird is that? That we both have self-esteem issues. Did I ever tell you? My dad texted me saying I should smile more in my selfies. Are you fucking serious? I am so serious. Oh, fuck your dad. <laughs> <laughs> Just, uh... <laughs> It's okay. I defused the situation by joking about it with him. Good. But it's still, it's still something I'm just like, what the fuck was that? Oh. <laughs> you enter the dark boiler room and trip over the pipe. Cursing, you find a light switch and gasp in horror. It's not a pipe at all. It's a long rubbery arm crawling around the room ending in a ventilation shaft. Coming closer, you can smell something vile and rotten. Check the vent. Oh, fuck yeah. High five it. I, I got, don't see any. I, I like how the music. No, because you have to click on it to activate because it's a jump scare. Oh, but, okay, like, I'm ready. Like, that's how. That's how. That's why the noise is like quiet. Oh, you, so you um, wouldn't hear it because I haven't fucking fixed that. Yeah, yeah, can't hear shit. Yeah, the like the music has, has specifically been muted. Like it's not gone, but it's like noticeably quieter. Oh, uh, okay, I'm ready. I'm spooked. <laughs> you almost fall to the ground when you see the wide open stare of the of the dead pervert. He's elongated <laughs> limbs, stretching and disappearing into the vent's darkness. Inside his mouth, you find a tiny key. Oh, thanks, sir. See? It was a pervert and a horror. I'm so smart. <laughs> <laughs> After the police arrive, the whole building gets searched. Following the arms, the detective finds the body of a man stuck in a ventilation shaft. Later, he's identified as the building caretaker. In his closet, police find pieces of underwear and voyeuristic photos of the tenants. Yeah, that, that tracks. You are questioned thoroughly and eventually released as the murder case is being covered up as a case of an unfortunate gas leak. Ending A. Oh. Gotta remember, these are normal people who don't want to deal with this shit. <laughs> I can hear all the true crime people going, No, I want to know about it! <laughs> Let's see what our effect is. Arcane Storm. Local scientists are baffled. An unprecedented aurora-like event has bathed the entire town in a natural green glow. Do you ever get to see an aurora where you are? Um, I don't think so. I supposedly saw a bit of it, like, forever ago. When it was really far south. Was it pretty? I mean... I, I'm doubtful it was actually an aurora, it was just kind of red. Yeah. It was it was fine. <laughs> it I mean, wasn't like the pretty shit you actually see in like photos and whatnot. 
the only sort of meteorological things I get to see is usually the effect of bushfires. Um, yeah. I I do get to see a lot of meteorological events. <laughs> now the important thing, people! People! <gasps> Creeper! Probably just my imagination. <laughs> it's never your imagination. Never. It's fine. No, it's not fine. It's fine. We have a cult after us. So, do you want to do ramen or the teacher? Uh, let's get the ramen out of the way. Food stuff grosses me out. The ramen so. runs nice and easy. That's a finger. Okay. Oh, it is a finger. I didn't notice it. I did, uh, that's the first time I've noticed it, and I've played this game a lot. <laughs> yeah, I think you're meant to miss it just because it's kind of, it's kind of there. Yeah. Out of thin air, a brand new ramen restaurant opens in town. It's adored by everyone. Once people take a bite, they can't stop. Day and night, the queues stretch out the door. The shambling customers stuff themselves with dish after dish, while the blind owner sits, sits silently behind the counter, grinning and polishing his gleaming knives. I, you are determined. This might be. What? This might be insensitive, but I I want the blind man to be safer polishing knives. <laughs> you are determined to discover what makes this ramen so enticing. What is this true power? Dog meat? Human meat? The flesh of the gods themselves? I mean, could you taste the flesh of the god th gods themselves? I honestly don't know, because I don't eat meat, so I don't know if I oh. would be able to literally stomach it. <laughs> yeah, I j I'm the wrong person. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Watching local news, you spot a familiar street. It's a feature about the newest ramen shop. The food critic has a manic look it as he describes the ramen. His, his descriptions make your stomach turn. I mean, it it is when when you, it's a, when you know weird shit is happening and people are acting weird yeah. about it. Discard. Oh, Wait. I don't, mm, I don't want to discard oh, items. No. Uh, oh, actually, I can discard the tiny key because it's. No, I can't. Damn it. So the thing about the tiny key is, it's only used in two other mysteries, and we didn't get them. Yeah. So it's literally useless to us. Okay. Uh, library notes. Yeah, I'm not using spells. That's one. I can't discard that. Motherfucking storage. Uh... Where can I go to get a free item? Let's just hope we get combat. That uh, knocking wakes you up in the middle of the night. Open up, shouts the deep voice from behind the door. I know you're there. You oh, I've been looking up like that. Ask what's the matter, or call the police. I mean... My roommate opened the door, and then I locked it after her and called the police, so I don't know which one to pick. But you gotta remember, no matter what option you choose, there is a good, bad, and a go-get-fucked like res resolution to it. I, um, I kinda wanna open the door. Oh, you mean you don't open it, we're just getting close and asking what the ma what's the matter. Oh yeah, let's do that. Before you can answer, the door's letterbox suddenly opens and an unknown inventor tries to look inside. You lurch back and shut. Poke it in the eye! <laughs> the man sees you and tries to get in, screaming curses the whole time. A neighbor calls the police and the attacker escapes from your apartment building. Rip. Yeah, get fucked, nerd. I don't. I've been woken up at like 3 a.m. by shouting neighbors. Yeah, I remember you t telling me about that when, as it was happening. All right, guess you were awake, and I was literally freaking out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you find an envelope lying on, on a pillow in your bedroom. Inside is cash and a note from someone who has been watching you. They wish you luck in your task and promise to meet you soon. Just how did this well, envelope they... end up in your bedroom? That is a good question. <laughs> is that a little hand on the note? Yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a little spooky hand. It's adorable. But now we have money again! Yay! The only true way to investigate is to get into the restaurant itself. Oh no! Okay, let's go! Spooky high five. If 
pair has been following <laughs> you since morning. You finally managed to lose them, but I can't shake the feeling that it will only get worse. Oh no! The cult! It seems that you are not the only one wanting to try it for yourself. You stand in line for hours. You question its fall on death ears and you're shunned. Oh no! Well, I'm used to being shunned, that's fine. Yeah, it's nothing new. I have a light source, it's called a camera! It goes <laughs> flash! <laughs> We're gonna end up in that other... in that game where you use the flash and take pictures of ghosts? Oh, fucking... Oh, I know the one, because I've literally played it. What, yeah, what the... what the frick is that called? Oh... Uh... I'm gonna Google it. Sit Fatal there. Frame! Yeah! That one! Yeah. It's been almost a year since a childhood friend moved away to another city. He left suddenly without even saying goodbye. In a recent letter, he apologized for the disappearance and asked you to remove the furniture from his flat because he wanted to sell it. In the envelope, you find a key to his apartment. Well, we kind of don't get a choice in this regard. <laughs> yeah. Well, moving... The wardrobe through the doorway, you take a wrong step and sprain your ankle. Oh. Ah, shit. It's nothing serious, but you'll have a problem walking for a few days. Poop. Oh, well, looks like I have an excuse to rest again. Such a shame. <laughs> I'm surprised how low our doom is. Because normally it's about 60% by now. Oh. Let's get downtown. I just need one combat encounter. <laughs> hey, I think we got one. You hear a faint sobbing sound coming from an alley nearby. There, you approach a man on his knees. When you take a step closer, he suddenly stops and perks up. You hear the nauseating sounds of tearing skin. Oh no! Oh my. Ooh, I don't like it. <laughs> Glued corpse. Glued? No, sir. Don't use glue on your face. Where is the... Look for an impro improv weapon. Boop, 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 boop. Save, launch. Oh, he does a lot of damage. He does minus two to, to stamina and reason. That sucks. Yeah. But I got a level up out of it! Yes! Art knowledge, plus one to perception, and we know shit about art. Fast learner, taking damage in combat gets experience bonus. That's not bad. Second sight, additional damage against ghost and eldritch enemies. That sounds good. Second sight? Okay. And then yeah. luck. Why not? Yeah. And uh, throw away the branch. You sneak into the alley in the dead of night. Gagging, you look through the restaurant's garbage. It's all vile pulp. Through, though a through, few chunks of meat look like promising samples. I mean, Smelly yeah, meat. unprepared meat looks gross. Rancid meat why is it sauce. Why is it rancid already? That's, ooh, that's sus. Sussy meat. Walking through the park, you find a little girl crying alone in the playground. When you ask what's wrong, she says that she can't find her mummy. Luckily, you spot the girl's address on her backpack lying nearby. Take her home or let the police handle it. Take her home. Well, you offer to take her home. When you get there, the terrified mother slams the door in your face. From behind the door, she starts screaming to get the girl away. The little girl calmly tells you that she can take it from here. Oh, um, uh, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I regret. <laughs> Rest. Rest. You just damn that family to, to such torture. Sorry. <laughs> Something is wrong. You don't see anyone in the street. And you could have sworn it was crowded just a minute ago. You better hurry out of here. Okay. With a slick hand, you, f you fill a vial with a soup and walk out, all without tasting the weird dish. Investigate, Good lemon. Good for us! Yeah! 
With the pulling of some delicate strings, you grab, you get the ramen into a lab. While handing over the gathered material, you, he you hesitate. Why would you? Si what would you send to the lab? Just the soup, oh. the soup and the meat. Oh. Oh, that that's ending A, but I haven't gotten ending B yet. So. Yeah, let's do it. A mere day later, your friend rings your door. His face is pale, and a shaky hand. She holds you an analysis sheet. You usher her in and bolt the door. You feel ill looking at the charts. While they couldn't identify some of the particles, they, d they did discover a highly addictive drug in the broth. The, the ramen restaurant must be closed immediately. Ooh. A week later, police and government officials are looking over the, the ramen, where the ramen restaurant used to be. Nothing remains but a gap in the street and aimless, confused customers. Ooh. You seem to believe that that was the end of it, but snippets in newspapers from other cities unsettle you. Brief articles about an exciting new ramen restaurant opening and its mysterious owner keep showing up. You can no longer eat noodles without feeling ill. Uh-oh. Yeah. Oh shit, we're getting close. No, not the puppy! E? The puppy left so we can't buy shit from him. No, no puppy! That can really fuck you up. No. Because you can get that tone one. Oh, oh, fuck. Uh, bath. Uh, we're full, so let's get some experience. Final one. A. Juvie used let's to be one it. of the most outstanding classes at the school, at least before their teacher's disappearance. Her replacement glides through the school, entrancing all those around her with a soft voice and calming, emotionless eyes. Now, she stands at the front of the class, scribbling a court symbols in chalk and hissing lessons about the old gods. <coughs> Excuse me. Children no longer play, but sit in the seats until dark, chanting along, learning of their eldritch masters and preparing to serve them. Oh, that's not good. Oh yeah, one thing I forgot to mention about this game, all this art, it's done in Windows Paint. Oh my god. Yeah. That's that's how fucking good the art is. This is all Windows yeah. Paint. Holy shit. Following a rumor, you visit the house of a schoolgirl who acted really strange in class. The girl's parents sit crying in the living room and fearfully point you upstairs. Uh-oh. Investigate downstairs twice. I mean, downtown, not downstairs. Oh, we're already downtown. And you enter a metro car, you notice an oddly shaped package on the seat opposite you. It's marked with your name. Ooh, we got another truly evil. When you yep. reach for the package, you stop suddenly, seeing a familiar face in a nearby advertisement. That's right, because this, this is actually an entirely separate event. Oh. It's all oh. about the package, but apparently when you get something evil, she takes over the, the event. <gasps> I don't think we're going to get it, though. We got it too late in the Yeah. Round. Yeah. Un unless we get fucking really unlucky. Yep. <laughs> Raining blood. Calm her down or check the bathroom. Uh, calm her down this time. Charisma check. Oops. Failure. When you touch her shoulder, she gets hysterical. Her reaction shocks you. You move away as more resident, more neighbors enter the corridor. Rip. Rest. No. Oh. Hmm. Evil. Three. Oh, that must have been in the home. Fuck, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah. I didn't realize that could yeah. spawn there. Huh. Yeah, it, it flashed there, and I was just like, what? Then you clicked away, and I was like, no. I, I didn't think shit could happen there. <laughs> that's okay. But look, it's up there. There's yeah. three. That's, that's concerning, because she's a really <laughs> strong boss. Oh, no. See? <laughs> The only metro line in your town connects to the university and the science complex. You could take a ride to gain some time, but you get the feeling something is wrong. Where are all the people? Take a ride, or decide to walk? Um... Decide to walk. Walking to your destination takes precious time, plus one durum. That's okay. Climbing a tree, you get a better view of the class. Weird schematics of some portal drawn on the backboard could help in the future. She sits in her bedroom in a blonde stained uniform, a dead rat laying in her hands. Ask, ask why she killed it. She just grins. Whoop! Okay.
Listen to the man or hang up immediately? Um, listen this time. Oh, we lost Doom, that's good. You learned some Yay. useful bits of information about your nemesis. However, if everything the man said was the truth, humanity is doomed. I mean, it always was. Yeah. I see that's you. There. Yeah! Four! Four evils. The former teacher of the classmate proved we are useful. Oh! You had no idea that the funeral you've been invited to would end with the guests slashing their hands to feed the deceased with their blood. You stand at the back, shocked by how grotesque it is. Suddenly, the, the guests turn their head in your direction. It's your turn. Uh, Follow the awful tradition, fight your way out, try to talk to them, use a local tradition as an excuse, which we can do because we've we got the, the perk. Let's do the local tradition as an excuse. Sending over the corpse, you clap two times and bow three times. Older mourners seem content with the sacrifice and let you go. You can't shake the feeling that the deceased smiled slightly. Yay. Level up. Outdoorsman. Plus one luck. Change the natural rhythm of life. Fast hands are switching of equipment during combat. Perception. Get an eye for art and details. Ah. This one is technically really good if you're trying to get one of the rarer characters, but we're too, way too late to be able to use it. Yeah, okay. But then again, it gives us one luck. I mean, one, I think one luck would be worth it. And the other two aren't really grabbing me. Yeah, and they're not really useful for the rest of this play there. Walking through the hosp hospital corridor, you hear a disgusting slurping sound coming from the closet. Bloodsucker. Oh, well, hi. Hey, look, it's you. It's me. Hi. Sorry, I, I, I gotta stab you. Oh. I'll be more slashing because the scalpel. No, oh, yeah. Okay, so every time we do it, she's just gonna appear now, apparently. Yeah, now we're up to five. <laughs> oh, right, I think it's, um... You don't need three, it's just the higher this goes, the, the higher likelihood you have of, of the, the fight occurring. Mm. The investigation is taking its toll on you. You start to miss the most obvious leads. Plus four doom. Poop. It's fine. As long as, as the doom is not above 80, we can win. Okay. Oh. In the distance, the bell tolls and everything gets dark. Your demise is here. Oh no. Is it evil? Something yep. truly evil. See that health? No, because part of Robin's message is over it ends in a five. Yeah, there's two other numbers before it. Oh no! It's a hundred and five. Oh, no! no! Uh, I have no regrets. <laughs> <laughs> so take two damage to do eight. No, we're literally just better off doing... Oh, hang on. Oh, I can't. I, there are options. Oh, I can't do normal combat. It's... Suffer for me, lose two stamina. Cry for me, lose two reason. Yeah, camera flash. Find the enemy. Can't run from this, I'm pretty sure. Right, it was. Clap, clap, bow, bow, bow. Oh, so that's how rituals work. Okay, that's something else then. Pray. Uh, I can't run from this encounter. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> no, it's fine. I've I've never actually like done the fight. I just knew this was real fucking hard. So, uh, 
Do we want to suffer or to cry? Uh, suffer. Bleed for me. Set remaining stamina to, stamina to three. Ooh. Mm. I'm pretty sure that's what we have to do. Okay. And we're dead. Oh no! Resisting the unknown horror was taking its toll on your health. Weakened, you finally succumb to your injuries. Alone. As the dust settles, you open your eyes. Reality starts to crumble. Old God is ready yep. to return once more. And she's dead. Yeah. <laughs> oh well. Well, we get to see the spooky opening. Continue. Customize. Do you have another seed, or do you want me to randomize? Random! Tell me when. Now. Yeah, we've been through this. It's okay. Bye-bye. Now, who do you want to play as? No. Uh. We did Mimi. We did. We could, we could always do Mimi again because I don't think I've finished a playthrough with her yet. Yeah, let's do Mimi. Same cult background. Yeah. Let's go back to that initiate. Yeah. Now what you got? Spider, Defire, Eye, or Mirror? Oh, the spider's down, uh, downside again. You can't run from combat. That's difficult. It's actually the, the, one of the best ones, because a lot of the easy fights are easy, and a lot of the really painful fights that you want to run from, you can't run from anyway. Okay, let's do the spider. Spider? Please. That's a big spider. He is a big spider. Excuse me. So much cringe your mailbox full of animal entrails. Sell it on the black market. <laughs> you know, that thing we have access to. Yeah. Okay, it's a new playthrough. What, what clothes should we wear? Uh, go through them again. Got the nurse, which is what she's currently wearing. Tank top. Pop culture. Good girl. Or surf. Tank top, please. Tank top. It it won't show it here because it's for whatever reason, but it's over here. Yeah. Okay, let's see our mysteries. Oh, that's a fucking brutal one. Ugh. Ramen. Parrot. Fuck, we got a lot of the hard ones. I'm going to reroll because those are bullshit. Okay. Red coat. Wish from Hazard Hell. Yeah, there we go. It's a nice selection. Is that found footage? The last one? Yes. Freaky feature of found Let's... footage. Can we do that one? Sure. Three students disappeared in the process of making mockumentary, I mean, a documentary about local folklore and legends of a nearby forest. Now, on the first anniversary of their disappearance, a suspicious man has started asking questions. He claims to be a private investigator hired by the, par by the parents of the students. Except the parents of your friends didn't hire him. Who is he? And what did the other students discover out there? Let's go visit the puppy, because we need to buy items. Puppy. Wait a minute. Equip scalpel. At least puppy back. 
Yeah, the puppy's back. Hey, puppy. The puppy is the best character. Yes, she is. Alright, now I want the compass for that. We aren't really getting a lot of items. Reroll. Hey, compass. What else do you have for us, puppy? Guess we're using the camera. Okay, rescue the mission. Location quick first. Three students disappeared in the process of making a documentary with the local folklore. Maybe you'll find a clue about the last known location in the school's newspaper. You enter the art workshop. The room is half cluttered with half finished sculptures and bizarre masks hanging on the wall. One sculpture strikes you as eerily realistic. Check out the sculpture or the masks. Well, the sculpture's naked, so... So you're choosing the horny option? Yes. Oh no! Hey, look, you got some head. <laughs> Instead of one sculpture looks so lifelike, give me a close hand, raise your hand, and as you touch it, it falls off. Prepare for combat. <laughs> Head this mess the stumbles out of the sculpting classroom and it's reaching for your head. No, on my head. Head this mannequin. Put um, a motorcycle helmet on top. <laughs> and, then it's, and then it's fine, and we're in an anime. Yeah, and then it's basically salty. Yeah. It looks like one of the previous owners <coughs> of this mansion liked to read. Dusty tones reach the ceiling. You don't have much time, but maybe you could spare a minute to look through the books, start with the shelves, check out the table. You don't have time for this. Ugh. Check out the table. Another check. Success. The notes lying on the table look like the ramblings of a madman, but you can see a method to their madness. Perfect. Legend says the witch was buried alive for kidnapping and murdering two children. Points you in a specific direction, potentially saving you some time. Hey. We're awesome. Yeah, we are. Stubborn receptionist. Getting access to the hey. database, database would certainly speed up your investigation. The receptionist would never allow it. If only there was a way to make it go away for a while. We don't have that ally. Talk to her. No. Prisma to check. Success. Unannounced inspection, she asked. Thank you for telling me. While well, the receptionist is busy updating some boring papers, he copies some names and addresses from the database. Uh-oh. Notes mention a village not far from your town. You decide to take a bus. Getting closer, you can't help but notice a large number of trees that have suddenly died. What happened here? Bug. Testing, can you hear me? Oh. I can hear it's you. It's a talk! Out there. Hey. Awesome. I don't have a picture yeah, for you, so you uh, can't show up. This... <laughs> Yeah, that's that's fine. I don't show up often enough to really ask for one, but uh, you, you appear to be the only server of mine that's actually functioning. Oh shit! Yeah, that was. Oh, it wasn't earlier when when we started. <laughs> the second he started streaming, it shut down. <laughs> yeah, it was uh. kind of funny. <laughs> wow. All right, so I'm gonna go back to troubleshooting. Y'all have a good time. I fucking love this game, even if I don't play it. I know it's so good. It's really awesome. Yeah, I, I've definitely recommended it to a good chunk of people. Yeah. Also, holy shit, you are doing well. Uh, we 19 just, stamina? We just started the second run where we died, because we encountered something truly evil. 
<laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Normally, I don't see one above, like, I don't know, maybe six stamina or a reason, so. Yeah, well, I am playing on, like, the second easiest difficulty. You? Sanity? Perish the thought. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was really just loving the, the the fucking octopus flipping you off with eight different tentacles. It's great. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> she made some great art. <laughs> yes. Oh, all right. I, I'm gonna roll on back to what I was doing, just saying hi and then fleeing again as usual. Oh, good. <laughs> all right. Bye. 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 <laughs> <laughs> While you walk through the crowded space, someone bumps into you and quickly apologizes. Realize what's happening. Perception failed. Before you realize your wallet oh, no. missing, the thief is long gone. I it wasn't my fault this it? time. I don't think we had money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember anymore. Everyone in the village is unsetting, unsettling, unsettlingly friendly. Old farmer points you to an old stone. The missing group supposedly started their forest trip there. Don't trust small towns. No, especially not creepy Japanese ones in a setting that has actual horrors. But also just don't trust small towns. Yeah. A seasonal floods that close many of the roads. Hmm, I think the game was trying to tell me something when it kept forcing me to take the map. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> oh, well. Okay. Alternate <laughs> way, let's go! You waste a lot of time looking for a safe path. Rip. Just ford the river, it's fine. Uh, this is the downside to, do to going to the fucking forest. It has its own little map if you're unlucky enough. Oh no. The forest and I think the village can fuck you over this way. You discover an old campsite located on the edge of a small clearing. The tent has been knocked down and the, f and the food and utensils have been scattered everywhere. Search the tent, investigate the ground for clues, ignore the tent. Uh, investigate the ground for clues. Perception check. Success. Footprints and tracks suggest a fight. The owner of the tent must have been dragged by two unknown attackers into the woods. Oh well. Okay. <laughs> oh well. The room in which, which house seems empty. In the basement, however, you find a camera pointed at the large hole in the ground. On the table next to the camera, you see three cassettes each titled after one of the missing friends. Then you hear a curious sound coming from the hole. Take the cassettes and run, or peek inside. Take the cassettes and run! Not being able to deal with it, you start to grab the tapes and run. You wander aimlessly through the woods for a few hours until you are found by a search party. You lead them to the house, but the door to the basement is missing. The case remains open. Ending C. Oh, okay. We don't even get to see what's on the tapes? Uh, no, the... There's supposed to be. There was something that was supposed to happen, but it just hasn't been implemented. Oh. <laughs> Which is really okay. weird because this is like one of the like the the first mysteries in the game when it was in early access, and it still mm. hasn't been done. No. <laughs> it's literally a oh. useless item. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Well, let's see what the old god did. The imposing shadow cast by the old lighthouse is getting longer each day. Oh, fuck off. The lighthouse gets an extra floor. That means it, it's an extra turn of getting fucked over. Oh, no. Let's level up. Yeah. Folklore, just knowledge, and then knowledge of ra ra random shit. Anatomy cast, extra damage against human enemies, which is like a third of the enemies. Then leadership, charisma, and the ability to guide others. What was the first one? Folklore. Where we know about random rituals and shit. Man, I'm always in for random rituals and shit. And then knowledge. Inside your mailbox, you find a small key. What is it doing there? more experience, because why not? Okay. Okay, I chose the last one, now it's your turn. Uh, okay, so two of these are the ones we've done before, but I don't have the other endings, so we're gonna go do the bad endings for them. Okay. 
let's do the ramen because I already know both the endings to that. And I can just show you what the other ending is now. <laughs> Alright, I could discard items. Uh, I might not be able to show you everything. <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't have money either. Uh-oh. Um, I think if I go to the police station... Yeah, I can give it 11 experience for a fund. Do that twice. Now I have two fund. Oh, hey. That guy encountered the eels too. Lost an eyeball. Oh, damn. Energy drink. Discard. And I gotta hope I get into a fight. Hey! <laughs> Just as I needed money. Yeah! <laughs> Read the letters or check them later? Uh, check them later. You, you place letters on the kitchen table, feeling an anxiety attack coming on. My anxiety attack is giving me way less stamina. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're not doing that one. <laughs> um, share your experience. Oh, uh, right, to share experience, you actually need experience. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> no, that's my bad, I should remember that. Oh, it, it's always... See, the shovel is, is one of like the best early game weapons to get, and I usually always grab mm -hmm. it, but I haven't been grabbing it because we've been getting the scalpel. Yeah. <laughs> It's getting dark as you arrive at the cemetery. Shadows move in fantastic and unaccountable ways between the tombstones. Finding the right grave may prove to be a challenge, especially when you feel someone's gaze on your back. Continue Confront the stranger! <laughs> a priest from the nearby temple asks what you are doing. When you can't make up a lie, you are thrown out. <laughs> yeah, sounds right. <laughs> uh, rest. Hey, look, it's safe to rest. Yay. It's the glued man. Oh, hi, man. It's good because I, I needed to fucking look for something. Ugh. Seventy-six times, so I can go boop, 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 and boop. Yeah. Then discard the branch, and we got the meat again. Yeah. Do I want to follow the weird man, call the police, or do nothing? Uh, follow him. Zip check failure. The door is locked, and you think you can repeat the knocking pattern that the suspicious man used. Nothing happens. Damn it. We can't get into D&D. <laughs> We're not cool enough. Yeah. Chat or invite for coffee? Uh, let's chat. Charisma check. Success. In between conspiracy theories, that's the same answer. Except it didn't no. cost us money. It gave us experience oh. instead. Yay! <laughs> okay, sure. Investigate the lab. See, I told you chat and coffee were the same thing. <laughs> yeah, fucking apparently. Wild <laughs> and meat. Please, please. Look at the charts, I cannot believe your eyes. While the standard test didn't detect anything weird, adding drops of human blood revealed something horrible. Whatever this thing is made of, it's alive, beating a self-pulse against the glass. Your friend leaves you with the papers, muttering and accused of preparing to flee to the next town on a train. 
Oof! Hey, look, the finger's back. Prepare for prepare for a fight. You march down to the restaurant. However, you find no Eldritch Horror to duel. Instead, you're shocked to find nothing but a gap in the street. You ignore the distraught customers still lining up where they remember the entrance. <laughs> Investigating the ground, you see something glisten where the kitchen used to be. Cautiously, you look at the chunk of meat and then jump back with a yell. As it flexes, it opens a weary eye, grins, and wanders off on stubby black claws. You walk home shaken. In your head, you hear the weird ramen breathing in its bowl. You only stop to throw up on the street. Oof! Yeah. Creepy. Dun dun dun! Freaky flood. Did the water level suddenly increase, or is our city slowly sinking? Uh oh. Okay, so going to the seaside will make us drenched, whatever that means. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, we forgot to do our most important thing. Check the people for the creeper! Well, one of the creepers. Yeah. Uh, what's my stats? Eh, I'll go experience anyway. Gotta risk it for the biscuit. I like it. <laughs> Uh, let's leave the ha household health for last. Okay. So, arms or Akamanto? Um. Arms. Okay. So we ha we can't do the bonus objective. Yeah. What's the bonus objective? Can't go to the hospital, that's fine. Oh, small cocoon. You wonder what kind of animal the spider caught in its web. You scare away the annoyed predator and rip open the cocoon to reveal a human finger. Ooh, creepy. It gave me the finger! You got it. You got it. <laughs> and now you can give oh, people no. the finger! We got, a, we got a ring. Uh oh, patina ring? Plus one dex, minus two max tam. Surprisingly huh. light. Huh, okay. Looks like it's going to fall apart any second now. Okay. Should we keep it or sell it? I'm okay with selling it. Cold or hot bath? Hot. Hot. Hot bath is so inviting that you spent an, an extra hour in it, plus one doom. Hot. Buy. Hot. Buy off. The telephone sounds and one voice is too loud for you to ignore them. When you enter the apartment, everything turns silent. <gasps> okay! Hey, level up! <clears throat> okay. Us learner, outdoorsman, or art knowledge. Uh, outdoorsman. Listen to him or hang up. Um, hang up. Intimidated by the unsettling portrait, you're haunted by nightmares. Coward. Expensive or cheap? Cheap. You buy a can of off brand soda and take a sip. It tastes a little odd, but you enjoy the drink anyway. Hey. Now I want soda. You can always get yourself one. Good. You should I it. should also food. Food is important. Food is important. Maybe you should order that. I'll be gonna do it. Calm it down or check the bathroom. Uh, check bathroom, please. We don't enter it. We do, we go back and explore the bo explore the boiler. Investigate the boiler room. Go to the top boiler room. Trip over. Okay. 
and okay, how's that different? Push for the get search for the arms. Um, so you can a caretaker. That doesn't. How do I get ending B then? Hmm. There's something wrong with the tap water. It's black and oily. This thing's smelling like death. You hope it's just a temporary issue. Oh no. God damn it. So now we can't technically use the bath f f f f to do anything. Oh, it's not good. Nope. And we were doing that last. Now we were fucking up the cape. What's the other ending for the cape? Um, if I remember correctly, it's you just. Well, technically, there's a secret hidden ending, which is die to him, and you get a, se a special ending. But, um, okay. the B ending is do any of the other options besides the ones which gives you the true form. Okay. So we should just talk, do it normally and not, not do the bonus. She is not looking okay. No, she's not. Steal any gun, check the wound, or escape before more people arrive. Check the wounds again. Why not? Hey, we got a level out of it. Yeah. Fast learner, quick thinking, or leadership? Quick thinking. Check out the sculpture or check out the masks? Masks. Ritual mask. Ah, that's where you get the ritual mask. One mask looks similar to the design you once run in a cult book. You decide to take it with you. Mine. Just just take it. <laughs> uh, Ignoring oh, reason lock. Yeah, <laughs> that's good for her. Inspect. Ghastly pale yellow in colour. <gasps> like the painting of the pale... Yeah. Yellow person. <laughs> it's almost like a ghastly pale yellow means something in Eldritch Isn't a yellow king a thing? Yeah, the king in yellow. Yeah. Is it? Is that connected? I'm, that I'm, connected? I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that's what the connection is, yes. Yeah, I'm so smart. And that, well, I can replace our camera. And if you look at a portrait... I know. We, we, oh, we get the weather mask. We're... Oh, they're so cute! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know much about Eldritch entities. That's what you know me for. Yeah. You blend in with the hospital staff and make your way into an unmarked ward where a particular patient catches your eye. They look to be catatonic, eyes glazed over, shallow breathing, but of most interest are they regularly gross along the abdomen. It wouldn't be much of a nurse if you ignored them, right? They need help. Inspect or excise the growth. Um, because we are we um, are a nurse. Oh yeah, that's true. Um, excise the growth. I want to see what it does. Let's well, check success. You set your scalpel to work and carefully cut out cut away the tumor, only for it to immediately regenerate. This needs to be studied further. You pocket a sample of the tissue with breathless glee. This research could do the medical community some incredible good. And God, isn't it just so fascinating? Ah, oh, God, that's a scientist. Plus five stamina adds a new status. It's undulating slowly. Oh, no! Slimy That's and gross. smelly. What is it? It's pulsating slowly in your hand. No! Don't touch it with your bare hands! It's fine. No! <laughs> Let's get school. Barely dodging a knife swing, you fall to the ground. Shorthead woman giggles and take a step back. You can run from us, but you can't hide. 
friend. Oh no. Cultist Hunter A. Oh hi. Now I'm going to show you something cool. Take yes. This. Oh, no. Let's equip the camera. So I think it, it fucks with us. If we equip, if we use the lump of flesh, it should give it should give us a status effect, which we can see. Okay, okay. Oh, it didn't. What, what, did, it, what did it give us? Oh, uh, fuck off. It gave us a No! Well, that's what I get for playing with it, because sometimes it'll actually, like, grow lumps on you, or there'll be stuff that appears on your face. Oh, gross. Yeah. Like, and if you're, like, if you're fighting an enemy that does a lot of, like, cutting attack, and they, they decrease a lot of stamina, you actually just get, like, permanent wounds on your face from it. Oh, yeah, yeah. And there's a certain enemy that will cut right through your cheek, and if, if she does that attack on you, that's, the, that's how you look for the rest of the playthrough. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Stone statues. Experts are baffled by the sudden appearance of 20 stone statues lined up in a row in the middle of Brunk Park. You can cast one spell without paying for anything. I don't nice. have a spell. <sighs> Helper or decline? Decline. She, Fuck. She insists. Okay. <laughs> you think you'd have learned your lesson from last time? No! I never learn my lesson. Hurt yourself. I wait until I'm right and then I lord it over people. <laughs> Red or blue paper? Uh, blue. As you feel the neck, it starts choking you. You kick him and rush to the door. You hear a click coming from the door's direction. You're locked in here with the crazy man. Oh no! It's okay, he only does 6 damage total. Oh, that's still a lot. Well, technically it's 3 stamina and 3 reason. Mm. Oh yeah, and we get his mask if we kill that version of him. Oh cool. Blood flowing from the wound of the tall man's red coat makes it look like the man was slowly melting. You hear a cackling coming from behind the mask and faint. And faint. Uh, when you wake up. <laughs> oh, we're wearing a ritual mask, Robin. I'll show you in a second what the other masks we have available. And when you wake up, he's gone. Somehow, you know, he'll still be back in another stall, another school, another city, continuing the horror. Wait. Roads leading out of town were closed by police, you have to find a new way out. Uh oh. Okay, but anything outside the city costs more doom to explore. Okay. Uh, it sucks, but it's not bad. We're only at 30% doom. 39. Yeah. Where is it? Okay, so. Boop. Boop. That's what we normally look like. Mm hmm. That's, that's a mask that we come across. It's actually relevant to some achievements when, when you combine with our other items. And then you have his mask. Alma, Eldritch. Oh, it's not going in place of my compass. Fuck off. Yeah, fuck that. I'm going to put that mask back on. I like that we just walk around town with this mask. Yep. And no one cares. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't remember what this one is. There are many odd mansions around this town. Oh, uh, it's this one. This one's fucking complicated. Uh. All right. Uh, before, before we do it, rest. Because <laughs> any big fight's gonna fucking kill me. No. There we go. Let's get seaside twice. Uh, that's not a great idea, but okay. Cliff. Great. Oh, that can't go wrong. 
You decide to enter a small shady bar in the docks. Maybe some of the old fishermen can help you in your quest. However, persuading them to do so might prove difficult. Try talking to them, buy them around. Buy them around. No fisherman would refuse a free round. They tell you tales of sunken cities inhabited by underwater things with too many legs. Friends you've talked with are not sure where the mansion itself is located. You have to find the mansion first. A trip to the library may shed some light on it. Alright. Pity we're not going there yet. Okay. Ugh, I hate that picture. Architect's Journal. You learn the cliff the mansion was built on is famous for its extent. Oh no, this is a different mansion one than the one I'm thinking of. Okay. Thank fuck. This is, this one's fucking annoying, but it's not that one. One house owner, however, has to make use of the cave tunnel. It's a natural concert hall, he claims. Article covers a group of scientists from Tokyo. They were exploring and mapping weird cave formations found in the cliffs. Search of, of the missing team of scientists continues. The only clue so far is a code written on the cavern wall. 45 hertz. 150 hertz. Uh, fucking you can be sold. Because I want to try something. Hardware store. Yes. Is that an equipable? Okay. Now I'm set up for potentially fighting something. Cause apparently right. acid's good against Elder Taurus. Huh. Suddenly a window behind you breaks with a bang. Startled, you notice a masked man hunting rifle in his hands. Silent and calm, oh, the man loads another bullet in. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I have the same mask! I know, right? We had that. No! We're buds! We had the same mask! <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, fucking five stamina damage. Oh. Pick, wait, what's that? Oh, damn! <laughs> Let's go feast on an elder chore now. I think we actually... Good. Where do I get bullets from? <laughs> Put the acid in the barrel and shoot it at the... <laughs> That's not how guns work and you know that. <laughs> oh, where do you get bullets? Up your butt. Oh, you. <laughs> Do we need to be a Yakuza member to get bullets? I don't know. Could you look that up for me? Where to get bullets? Yeah, what a horror, where to get bullets. Yep. Because one of the endings in this is to fight something that a normal person can't actually fight, except I have got the two items that could potentially fight it? Wait, I... Uh, I... It just extra ammo keeps popping up. Is that a thing? Yeah, ammo that works. Same thing. Bullets are ammo. Um, it says... <sighs> I don't trust this. It says, um... It says... You need to complete the House of Paper achievement to unlock extra ammo, which is capitalized, which you should... Fine in the illegal den. I don't think they understand the ammo I'm asking for. No, no, that's the, that's that's the right thing. It, it, it means okay. I, it means I do, I haven't unlocked the ability to get ammo yet because okay. I don't I don't have the illegal den. Okay. Because like you see how there's only one thing here. Some achievements mm -hmm. unlock extra extra areas. Uh, okay. Yeah. So I think I have maybe a bullet. No. Oh. Well, oh, well, do we want to just sell gun then? No, because I, th I think you, you get one shot. Okay. It comes with one bullet in the chamber. Yeah. Someone taps you on your back. Uh, so sorry, is the bush still running? I'm so late for a meeting. The bush is going to kill me. Startled, you quickly turn around, shocked by what you see there. 
That's a tapeworm man. Hello, tapeworm man. Who's your boss? I don't think we want to meet his boss. Hey, level. So, art knowledge, anatomy, or leadership? Um. Anatomy. I can tell you that the thing we're about to fight is definitely not human. Oh, um, leadership. For charisma. Okie dokie. I don't know shit. I'm just choosing shit. Yeah. Don't even tell me I'm gonna say no if it's like, uh, no, that, that's, fuck, that's no point to that. Okay. <laughs> like, it, it, like, it, um, unless, like, if there is literally no negative, but there's, like, no positive, I'm not gonna s say no. Okay. <laughs> City docks. The town's docks are a mix of modern warehouses, small shops, and bars where the alternative crowd gathers. An ancient wooden temple occupies a small hill at the town center. Look for a warehouse job, try to recruit allies, pray at the temple. Um. Try to recruit allies? Hey, we've got an ally. And then take yeah. someone willing to join you at the bar. You explain everything you know, so far, so a few drinks. Ryoko. Plus one to weapons damage. Nice. Fuck yeah. I, I know a faster way. <laughs> you like a gun, obviously. Oh, I didn't realize you could just talk to them. Looks at like you waiting. Oh, you can't. I lied. Well, she doesn't believe in talking. <laughs> She's a woman of action. Yeah. The whole building begins to shake as you enter the room. Suddenly, a stone pillar bursts through the floor where you stood just seconds ago. Noticing the arcane symbols painted on the stone, you take a step closer. Touch it, retreat, or study the symbols. Study! Success! You recognize some of the symbols from a stone tablet you saw at the museum. What's the connection? Uh... Bad stuff. And now we got another fucking little mini-map. That's why I hate the mansion. You were startled when you discovered that headless body. You were horrified when you saw its head hanging in the cent in the middle of the room and laughing. Well, at least they have good humor about their situation. <laughs> it's a pretty hairy situation. Ah, they're just trying to get ahead in life. <laughs> uh, <laughs> With the black lovely. hair. That's never a good sign. <laughs> now our situation is hairy. Lines with sewing kit. Especially in Japanese what? horror. You can sew yourself a hair costume and be Bayonetta. I wonder if that makes it reusable, like the sewing kit. That's weird. Maybe. I wouldn't sew with hair. See, look at how fucking horny this is. Um, but, yeah. The investigation can wait. The whole bath is too inviting. Take a bath or no time for it? Uh, no time for it. As running as it may be, you have more important things to do. Minus three doom. Perfect. Oh, we only need one more percent doom. <laughs> well, we'll, we'll literally get it. <laughs> Yay! And then we got rid of no. it. No! <laughs> <laughs> you find a heavy turn wrapped in moth-eaten black velvet in an old locked cabinet. When you remove the book's wrapping, you recoil in disgust. It's bound in human flesh. Read it, burn it, take it. Uh, um... Read it. Read the Necronomicon. Yes. Yeah! <laughs> Walking through the forest, you spot a pair of legs sticking out of a bush. Before you can do it, huh? Do anything, however, they twitch and move. Just a bush person. Oh, it's a man eating plant. Oh, oh hi, Audrey. No, there's not enough personality for that to be Audrey. Aww. It's not gonna sing me a song or anything? No, unfortunately. Damn it. What did you name your guy in Warframe the wall? The no. Flesh Forge. You would. Everyone's making stupid puns. It's like, 
Fine, I'll treat it seriously. Just like how, I... just like how fucking everyone named their pet after food is like, no, mine's Gree because it's the greedy cat. No, I named my uh, flesh thing George. <laughs> Why George? <laughs> I don't know. It just seemed like a normal name. Of course, you you give the giant talking meat flower the name of George. Yeah. There's a local legend about a heartbroken seamstress. One stormy night, she broke into a local inn and stitched the unsuspecting guests together. Her final gruesome artwork. That's just a legend, right? Rifle through the cupboard or check out the sewing machine? Check out the sewing machine. Fucking jump scare piece of shit. On the sewing machine, you spot a strange engraving. When you get closer to investigate, your mind is flooded with forbidden knowledge. You leave the room quickly. More forbidden knowledge! Invisibility. Till the end Noi. of- I, I don't use that. Aww. But I can get rid of it. For one reason. Back from piracy, yo ho! Did you enjoy the gay pirate shoe? <laughs> don't play this <laughs> You feel watched. Retreat, because I don't have a holy candle. Yo, I like little eyes. I know, right? Just little dots. Little dots. That's why I hate the mansion. Like, look how much we've explored of it. Mm. Ooh, a garden. Towering. Oh, round window of a crooked manor, manor tower is calling you. You feel your strength drain away as you stare at the bright light. Fight this feeling, get lost in it, and force yourself into hiding. Uh, fight this feeling. Get lost in the light. Okay. <laughs> Blinding light is growing larger and larger. To your shock, you can't feel the ground under your feet. Shoo, why did you say that? Now I'm gonna have to change the color. I can't Where have Christmas colors. You? Oh, you, you'll, you'll see. <laughs> Prepare for yourself for whatever is coming. Lost in time and space, you drift in nothingness until something pulls you towards the light. A parasitic star is looming, looming over a dying civilization. Is this the fate of our planet as well? Um, I entered the destroyed temple. Okay. The only one I know is this because you usually get an item out of it. I haven't. I, I, oh. I never do the other ones. Let's do the other one. In, inside no. the decaying oh. nave, you find a keepsake from the ancient world. Countless skeletons and corpses are shriveled in the arid air. You aren't sure what to expect. Study door to the study open. Oh, the sturdy door to the. I can read, I swear. <laughs> the creek. The dark and dusty room is empty, but something feels wrong. A faint draft, perhaps? You move the rotten carpet aside to reveal a secret passageway out directly inside the cliff rock. Make your way down. Make your way down. Following a strange song, you discover a hidden passage that leads you to an underground chamber connected to the sea. You can't find the source of the sounds, but then it hits you. The acoustics of this place make the wave sound like the most beautiful serenade. Mesmerize, you step closer to the stone altar at at the end of the room. Step closer or explore some more. Explore. Good choice. Oh, we don't have a light source, so we can't. Aww. Step closer. Uh, I guess step closer. So we're not we're not gonna see the giant eldritch space tentacle that comes out of the ocean. <laughs> Damn it. The only chance coming from the caves connected to the mansion must have driven the family insane. No connection to the outside world, they fed on what they had. Themselves. However, this doesn't explain the fresh corpses and wet tracks around the altar. Go to the store! <laughs> Eat yourselves? Cut off from the outside world. The whole town stopped receiving any outside signal. It must be the radio mast failure. Mm. Uh, that okay. doesn't look good. Yeah. So we have all five keys now. Yeah, the downside is I don't have a way to heal. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, yeah, can't investigate a mystery, which means I got to go to the lighthouse. What's the button? Oh, I, I get a level up. Uh, 
yep, that'll, that'll do. And that yep. way we can get some healing out of it. And then, uh, yeah. five stamina. That's got everything covered. Uh, oh, right, people. Nothing. Um, Sardiner. Oh, there we go. Thank you. I knew there was a button to it. Lighthouse. The ominous lighthouse has been closed down for longer than you can remember. Enter. What will Pelox prevent you from entering the building? Oh. Okay. Like someone wanted to keep us out or something. Enter the lighthouse. I don't know if God. Oh. Room, but it's the health and the and. It's both health that I'm concerned about. Find the man inside the cursed lighthouse. Your gut is telling you two things. That whoever, or whatever, is behind the weird events must be on the highest floor of this place. And that you should run away from this place as far and as fast as you can. You're afraid that there won't be a way back once you start climbing these. Let go! Uh, oh, I can rest. Let's risk it for... That paper on the wall looks like boobies. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a corrupted yellow sign. Oh, well. No, it's a butterfly. No... It's like oh. the two big ones and the little ones. Yep. Or boobies. <laughs> two sets of tits. Mm -hmm. Start climbing. Right, and this is six levels instead of the normal five. Yeah. You're stopped by a girl wearing dirty black school uniform. I'm sorry, but I can't let you go any further. She says, reaching for her bag. It's too late anyway. You instinctively take a step back when you notice a knife in hand. You have to think fast. Try to reason with her. Try to talk her into allowing you pass. It's too late anyway, she whispers again, letting you continue. The delinquent girl nods sadly as you pass her. Oh, we gotta yeah. pass that check. Yeah. Following the winding staircase, you find a metal gate that blocks your way. The cable that should be powering it is currently disconnected. The power box itself is covered in weird, moist goo. Just inhaling the fumes make your eyes itch and water. To power the gate, you'll need to disconnect a faulty plug. Not enough strength. You're surprised at how much effort it takes to disconnect the faulty plug. As you force it, the weird goo burns your fingers. Finally, you manage to separate the faulty plug and connect the proper cable. With a buzz, the gate opens. Following the winding staircase, you are stopped. Wait a minute. Someone broke into your apartment, stole all the clues and newspaper clippings, and pinned them here. The more you study, study them, you discover you can't remember any of them, except one. Select the title of the second mystery you, you investigated. Oh no, what did we do? It was ramen, because we did freaky footage first. Uh huh. And then ramen for the second. Yeah, because we the other end. get away, and then you said arms. And then we did a cape. cape. No, I mm -hmm. did arms and then you did cape, yes. So it should be ramen. Yeah. Your newspaper clipping of a case you seem to remember. Underneath it is a tiny button. You press it and, with a buzz, the gate opens. We're, cl we're clever. Following the one in the you are stuck. Oh, wait a minute. Someone has taken photos focused on you. The photos include the enemies you fought with. There's something wrong, but you can't precisely say what. It's like the second enemy you fought this run. Oh god, I can't remember. I don't think it was the Headless Mannequin. No. I feel like it was one of these two. I'm gonna say glued... No. The glued corpse happened near the ramen one. I think it was the glued corpse. Yeah, that sounds right. Hey! Grip the photo, and underneath it is a tiny button. You press it end, the buzz, the gate opens. Coming up the winding staircase, you are stopped by a masked man wearing an expensive suit. The rules have changed, kiddo, he says, taking off, taking the jacket and the mask off. Nothing personal, really. Oh. Oh. Well, yeah. He hasn't been, he's not relevant for us. Oh, that's right. Fucking two doom. This motherfucker.
Yeah, I don't, I don't think we have the, uh, the location that has Takashi-san. Oh, okay. Um, 89% doom. No, that sucks. We can manage it, yeah. Trail of Blood Electricity. Following the winding staircase, you are stopped by a metal gate. The tiny page nailed to the gate explains that opening the gate requires you to grab two metal rods. Using your own body as a natural conductor, you will power up the gate. Grab the metal rods. Hey! Yeah. You're about to grab the rods when you notice the dials and buttons. You toy with them for a bit before adjusting both voltage and current so it's safe for you to grab them. With a buzz, the gate opens. <laughs> the we're smart. So smart. Dark clouds swirl around the lighthouse. Did you arrive too late? Did we? Oh. No, we won. Yay! You just have to get up here before a hundred doom. Oh. As a natural fox slowly lifts, you are relieved and collapsed on the floor. Next day, everything Did feels it. like a bad dream. You've managed to stop the. I'm trying to read. <laughs> Messed stop Motherfucker. <laughs> you managed to stop the ritual awakening the Eldritch Old God. But what's done is done. It will stare in its slumber once it will stare in slumber again and again. The stars are right once more. Congratulations, you are safe. For now. Yay! We did it! Yeah, we did, we're good. Holly, are you waiting outside my door? Did you want to do one more run, or is that good enough? I'm good. Thank you so much for playing it. Yeah. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Ugh, I always have fun playing this game. It's so good. That was really fun. I enjoyed that. Yeah, and it gets better once you actually start unlocking shit. Mm -hmm, I bet. Time, next time we do, I'll have to open a guide so we can actually get specific encounters and start that. Okay. Yeah. And so you know a little bit about the game, so I don't have to be like, ooh, what's this do? <laughs> yeah. I just go, yeah, do this, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm smart, we established this. <laughs> okay. Good night, everybody. Bye. Bye.